All right, so today's video, we're gonna be exploring the creek and trying to catch some trout, possibly smallmouth, and some fall fish. Oh, so if the camera quality is bad. It's because it's in a waterproof. Phone, my phone is in a waterproof phone case because I may or may not have had a, a kayak incident like a week ago and destroyed my other phone when I capsized. Lost a couple rods, but get back. So we're gonna be fishing with. Right now we're walking up to the spot and we're gonna be fishing with a, or I'm gonna be fishing with a little, I don't even know what it's called. What's it called? Wait, what is it? Oh, it's, the, a, it's like a little, uh... it's not jerk bait. It's a, I don't know, mini crankbait. Yeah, yeah, it's a mini crankbait on the ultralight Shakespeare. I don't even know what real this is. Light speed, speed, speed spin. I don't know, something I found. Uh, This is Jackson. He's gonna be using a, ice fishing rod reel on an ultralight uh ugly stick oh, and we'll, we'll catch you guys at spot see ya all right guys we just found a snake here can you hold my rod hold my rod we'll get the net out and try to catch it where'd he go he went under this rock all right so he's under this rock somewhere i can try to push him out with my rod hey, wait let me get up there. That's a big snake, though. We gotta be careful he doesn't. I think I can't tell if it's a if it's a eastern Mississauga one. We can't catch it. They're endangered. Oh, see, it. it has to be under the rock. Poke it out from under that rock. It might be an eastern Mississauga. Um. Ready? Yeah, I'm ready. He shouldn't be coming. He if he does, he might try coming over this way a little bit. You sure you went under that? It looked like he. Yeah. Oh, I think I saw him. He was, he was going in between this rock. I think he's under this rock now. I think he's under this rock. Yeah, I didn't feel anything. This rock? That rock, yeah. There's a bunch of minnows under there. A couple, like, decent creek chub, but... Or, like, little creek chub, but... I, I think he went up under... Where did he go? So he was under this rock. I think he's under this rock. Poke your stick up under that rock. On the ground. I'm pretty sure he was up there. No. Nothing. I think he's under this one. I'm not seeing anything. Ass, whatever. Yeah. Alright, well, pit stop didn't work out. See you guys at the spot. All right, guys, we're walking up on the spot now. Kind of seeing a couple, bunch of schools of minnows. Um, looked like there's a, I don't know. But last year we were here, there's a bunch of more schools of minnows. But last year when we were here, uh, see, there's a bunch of minnows. But last year when we were here, we were here with another guy, actually Madden. We were at Madden, and we, under that rock, there was a massive, uh brown water snake and a massive humongous bullfrog that we actually ended up catching and making frog legs frying up some frog frog legs oh slipped um does look deep but we fished here a few times before holy cow look at that massive crawfish oh my that thing is huge looks like it just died too maybe from the rainstorm like washed up here. Never seen anything. I've never seen a crawfish this big. At least, in, at least, that, that, in, that, yeah. At least around here. I have. I saw one. It was like this big. It was huge. Like that would be an eater if it was still alive. I don't want to eat this. Yeah, he's a little. He's a little mushy. We're gonna leave him here. Honestly, might come back later. And if we, we were thinking about maybe going to a pond that we found, but we might not. We might. If we're catching fish in the creek, we're probably not gonna go there. Yeah, that frog and that big snake are right under this, uh, right under that big, I don't even know what that is, cement block? Right, I think we're going to be fishing under this bridge. See how deep, deep it is and I just slipped again. Alright, we're going to see how, we're going to see how deep it is. And if it's deep enough, we're going to start fishing. I don't even know if this might not even work, so I might tie on like a split shot and a 
fly that I tied, but we'll see, because Jackson was saying he was catching them on, like, a fly. But I don't, I don't know how I'm going to cast with this ultralight with a fly, but we'll see. Looks deep enough. I mean, it's at least three, four. Maybe the deepest spot right there is about five feet, maybe. And it looks a little deeper over there, too. But might take a few, few casts here, and yeah. So I'm going to let him take a couple casts, and then I'm going to set you guys down, and I'm going to start taking three casts. So hopefully one of us hooks up to something. We are right here, and we would have to walk all... This is where our bikes are right here. Mm -hmm. We have to walk all the way to here. Okay. Put a pinpoint somewhere and see how far that is. Can't be that far. Doesn't look that far. Yeah, it's not that far. But that's on the road. Yeah, I know. Even in the creek, it's, in the creek it's not that far. It, it looks farther, but like you're going that way. Yeah. Or, yeah, you're like, you're going from there and just going up like that. So it's not that bad. Yeah. We could walk. All right, guys. So we are walking up on the spot right now it's right behind it's literally it looks really deep so i might actually tie something back on hopefully there's some big trout maybe some i mean maybe like a some big trout like a steelhead or rainbow maybe a brown trout but maybe hopefully i haven't i've never caught a smallie in this creek before so there could be smallies but i doubt it and actually those walleye were filleted so Somebody must be dumping them in here. But it's kind of nasty, but, I mean... You know, attract a bunch of snakes and birds. But... It smelled awful. Like, unbearable. But, here's the spot. Down the waterfall. It's actually a pretty cool waterfall. Really cool waterfall. It's like a slide, almost. Just gotta be careful we don't slip. When we slip, we're going down that thing and hurting. That's gonna hurt. We slipped and fell down that thing. I'm already slipping a little bit, so I just gotta be careful. Ugh. Not very deep in this spot, like right here. But I mean, there's like, like those canyons almost. I, I'm just gonna say canyon, but like, stuff. Hey, you said it was deep, but it's not very deep. Like, oh, it's over there. Like I can. Oh, it's over there. Well, so just. Walk over to that spot. I mean, I have high hopes for this spot, but I, then I don't at the same time because we haven't really seen any big fish. That hole right there kind of looks pretty cool. It goes under the cave. There's a bigger fish in there. That's actually really cool, but there's a bunch of like, bro, that's the fourth time you've fallen. Where's your phone this time? Put your phone in like your bag or my bag. All right, but this kid has no like stability. Bro, his phone's soaked. But yeah, there's like a whole cave system, as I was saying before this clumsy guy fell. Oh, here's the spot. I told you. So this is a spot, and it like probably is about twice my height, and I am five seven. So we're gonna walk over to we're gonna walk over here to the edge, maybe. Actually, yeah, I might give a couple casts right here. So yeah, we'll see. Um, I'm not taking a swim here. You are. You already fell. Bro, if you fell into that, like, you fell, like, you slipped forward. If you were walking up to that thing and flipped. Yeah, his, yeah, your phone's toasted, bro. His, you didn't even dry it off, and he's on a wet bag, so. But, yeah, I'm gonna turn off the, I'm gonna turn off the camera. Just because we haven't seen any fish yet, and if there's no fish, there's no point in recording wasting space so yep yeah. see you guys when we catch fish all right so this is the end of the video we actually did not end up ever even catching anything i'm just gonna post this because we saw a bunch of cool things like the snake and all those dead fish and the mass couple massive crawfish so yep thanks for watching but please hit the subscribe button hit the notification bell